Welcome back. New ways to reduce some stubborn fat and doing that without surgery and without pain or any downtime. It sounds too good to be true, but ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, it is. Here with more on that, plastic and re reconstructive surgeons, Dr. Payman, Daniel Poor, and John Lakey are here. Welcome, welcome back, guys. Doctors. Well, so when we're talking about this, what are some of the traditional ways that people address that extra they want to get rid of? Traditional ways have always been surgery. I mean, that's that was really the only alternative. Like liposuction? Yeah. Liposuction, liposculpture. Mm -hmm. and basically, the difference between those two are just the volumes of the amount of uh, Definitely. Aggressive, invasive. What's the new way? What are we talking about well, here? The new way, and the new way we try to do everything nowadays is less downtime, less pain. People mm -hmm. scared of surgery. People think surgery is bad. For plastic surgeons, we really like to operate. But we found something that really works, and this is the Zeltik cool sculpting technology, which really targets fat cells by freezing them. So by freezing the fat cells, we take mm -hmm. them to a temperature where we can actually make them so-called die, and they go away. So it targets fat cells specifically, and it does something very similar to liposuction, just not as aggressively with really no downtime when, and no pain. When it goes away, meaning what? It's flushed out in your system. It gets in. It just did. It, it, it goes away. somewhere. Absorbed. I mean, right? It's absorbed, absorbed into your by system. the body. Okay. Yeah, you know. So it's called cool sculpting. We have. You brought along a little video that helps explain sure, this. Can give you talk idea. us through it? Okay. Definitely. All right. So as we talked about, the you know fat cells have a different uh, freezing point, and so cool sculpting. What it does is it selectively targets and freezes these cells, and it triggers your natural immune response for the cell to die. And then your own immune system really comes through and selectively removes those cells. Now, it doesn't take away all of the fat cells, but you can see approximately a 25% reduction. Usually, the results can be seen over the course of the next six weeks to three months, mm -hmm. and uh, we've seen inches taken off. Can you repeat this process and it continues, or once you freeze the, those fat cells, there's no more left there to freeze. Sure, you, you can repeat the process because it depends how much fat you have, depends how much you want targeted. But like, like John was saying, about 20 to 30 percent gets taken away the first time around. You maintain your diet and exercise regimen, mm -hmm. and if you don't have enough that comes off, well, three months, six months after you do this the first time, you can come back you and can do it again. That. Does it Mo come back? If, I mean, if you eat and you don't take care of yourself, does it come back? These, you know, again, if you maintain your current weight and your diet and exercise mm -hmm. regimen, these fat cells are permanently removed. Now, we don't remove all of them, just 25%. Let, sure. Let's just mention, too, this is FDA approved, Absolutely. right? You, yeah, so this is, this obviously went through a lot of rigorous, uh, yeah, it's, uh, different protocols before you were actually able to use it. Okay. Okay. All right, so, so let me see if I get this right. A lot of cold onto the skin that's so cold only the fat cells react to it. And is that right? And the skin is fine. And it's gone. It doesn't get burned. Is there any risk? Is there any any other, you know, things to be concerned about with it? You know, I, you know, I think there are uh, the, the minimal risks. And usually what patients complain of most is there's either a numb feeling or there's a little uh, irritation and redness, sometimes some swelling afterwards. Mm -hmm. Very rarely will you have just a little bit of discomfort I immediately, but nothing that uh, is uh, that lasts longer than a week or two. Can we go? You brought Katie, and this is uh, Katie. Introduce us. She's she is a Katie's, office. Yes, she's our assistant. Uh, okay, works at the office, and you know she's going to demo this for us, or she's going to allow us to. She, okay, she has kindly uh, offered her her services to. Okay, allow well, she's going to get us. into position, and you brought some befores and afters, yes. real life. While so we, why don't well, while she we get gets her settled ready, in? Yeah. Let's share with you so at we're home. We're going to talk about these before and afters. First one we're going to show is uh, outer thighs that were targeted with a cool fit. There are multiple different probes. This was the cool fit. As you can see, the before and after there. It shows about a good 20% to 30% reduction, and this was shown three months after. Here's the love handles that we show. Big common problem that people can't get rid of, and if, as just it's clear as day, you can see yes. the difference of the hourglass shape that now is, is seen in that before and after. And last, um, but not least, is the abdomen and flanks. And this was multiple probes in multiple sessions, and they were done in the abdominal region and in the love handle flank region. And you can see there, three months after, there's a really nice result there without any mm. contour deformities as you can see sometimes with liposuction. Is there okay. any discomfort to the patient at all or is it minimal? Let's see. Yeah. We'll find oh, out. Okay. No, I'm talking afterwards because you were saying. No, it all depends. Now depending on where you target, love handles and flanks, never. I mean I really go that far saying never. Sometimes the lower abdomen they will have some discomfort for about a week to 10 days and when I say discomfort it's just 
Tylenol, Advil, we'll take care of it. Oh, okay. And that's, it, it really is well, that well, simple. Let's go ahead. We've asked Katie to go ahead. We put a microphone on her so she can actually tell us what she's feeling as she goes through this process. Yeah, and explain to what you're, yeah, take sure. us through the you procedure. Know, uh, ultimately beforehand, what we'll do is we'll take a certain area. You need a pinch in order for this machine to work. And so really what I'm gonna do now is apply, this is probably the worst part, it's a cold gel pad that oh. really uh, oh. allows, <laughs> Uh, allows the probe to have I'm uh, already a better out. contact. Sorry, I'm already out. I can't handle it. <laughs> <laughs> she puts her cold hands on the back of my neck every day. Yeah, and I, I, yeah I, I does. Can't take it. All right. So, so what are you doing now? I'm applying the, this suction probe onto this the targeted area. So again, this is the love handle region, and. What I'm gonna do is apply the suction device, and as you'll see, everything was now sucked into the machine, and this is the particular area being treated. Now, Katie, how, what are you feeling? Put this it just off. feels like a little bit of pressure, but nothing that I can't tolerate or anything like that. It looks like what I would used to do when I was a kid, I would take the vacuum hose and I would stick it to my That's cheek. That's how it feels. It would close. <laughs> you still I, do that. I should have been a plastic uh, surgeon, but clearly. Let me, this isn't anything you think, oh, I'm gonna apply cold and it'll go away. People can't go and put it in a plastic bag, zip it up and put it on your belly. It's not like that, right? No, no. That's, that's not gonna work. No, I mean, because people will think, oh, that's all I have to do is put cold things on my stomach and I could get rid of my fat. That's this, not how it works. Again, this this is brought to a selected temperature that is specific for targeting okay. fat cells. All right. How long does it have to stay there for a treatment? Per area, it stays on for one hour. Okay. okay. And then so, and then you need somebody a magazine? would. <laughs> but normally, we, normally we do, you know, an iPad or, or, or TV with a movie and they sit there and, and watch or watch out. a book or, or, or read a book or, mm -hmm. you know, do your texting or phone calls while you're in the office. The other thing you could see is you asked for the targeting of the, of the freezing, but this is also sucking in that area that we've marked. So it's targeting specific fat cells that are, bringing, are being brought into this canister. So by putting an ice pack on yourself, it's not going to It's work. not going to do that. Now she would, she would normally, your, or your client would flip over, patient would flip over, you do the other side. Side, Absolutely, yes. and you could do this. How long would, you know, do you usually do short sessions, or will somebody come and have the whole thing done? You know, it depends. We have patients that come in, and they'll spend the whole day there. So it'll be six hours, seven hours, uh, targeting different areas, yeah. and it's not something that would preclude you from doing multiple areas. The, sure. You know, again, with minimal downtime, and minimal discomfort, you can really target most of the areas all in the same day. How expensive is it? Normally speaking, this. There are different probes. There's a small and a large. The small and, and the company basically sets a price for everyone. So mm -hmm. there's no price gouging or competition, so everyone gets it the same. Seven fifty for small areas, fifteen hundred for large areas. Mm -hmm. And I like I said before, one treatment normally does help. People that are that are bigger and require more, sometimes we tell them, listen, liposuction is probably a better idea for you because yeah. you're gonna need too many sessions, it might cost you too much. It's so. just that gets you across the finish line. You Absolutely. work really hard and you just can't get out, you can't do can we I know it's only been on for a second or two in, yeah. in terms of it would be an hour, but if you were can you remove that? Can we see we what it would look it. like yeah. underneath? Sure. How do you feel right now? Feel good. Yeah? Let's no tingling or anything? Do you feel cold? Yeah. You, you do feel the cold yeah. from it, but so now okay. we gently remove oh. the probe. Oh, I see, yeah. And you can see the area that where the suction has been performed. And right. so really, uh, as this stays on for an hour, yeah. it, we liken it to almost a frozen stick of butter. And then afterwards, you simply knead or massage that area yeah. out just to make it nice and smooth. Will it will it only work what's underneath there and get tack it or not that's in it. the peripheral of it? Yeah, and that's, that's, that's the whole thing. The it's, it's in the area that we target. So okay. you come in, we get that pinch. You have to have a pinch. If you don't, it's not gonna work. But you get that pinch, you mark it out, and it will target this area. And as you saw in the before and afters, it really gave you that hourglass shape because we targeted the yeah. right areas. Well, I already know you did your tummy, and it looks great, by the way. <laughs> so I, you already went through the procedure once before, and so now yes. you... Yes. Fantastic. If you'd like to know more about this, go to Beverly Hills Plastic Surgery Group.com, and you can get some more information you on this. you have a card? That's wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> we're forming a line. Are you right. really forming a line? All right, line. we're forming a line to right. Sandy Dugan. She's up next. <laughs> hey, guys, that's right. Well, we've got the latest trends in watches and one of our all-time bestsellers, Plus a lot more, so come back for Hollywood Steel. <laughs>